All right. So here is my uh, feel free lure 11.5. I got this uh, about six months ago. Turned out to be really incredible looking boat and handles amazingly. A um, couple of things that I've done with this. I added the uh, Scotty uh, mount on the uh, Unitrack system here. Works good with any rods or anything that you want to add to that. Also, you can see uh, I have the hatch in the front. That's usually where I keep my uh, life jacket. Um, extra rods, anything like that that I want. A couple of new things that I added were uh, I just added this uh, Lawrence uh, fish finder, um, which is turned out to be really cool. There's not a lot of fish in the water today, but definitely could see them. And the neat thing with this, you have this sonar pod that comes with all of the fill frees. Make sure that's locked in real good. So this thing actually sits in there just like that. So you got your transducer right underneath there. A little bit of caulking, a little bit of uh, weather stripping, a few screws, and if I can do it, pretty much anybody can. So I got that. I've upgraded. I got the uh, 150 centimeter angling poles. These are the send ones. Pretty nice pole. In the back there, I have uh, my crate. Usually keep a couple beers, some cocktails, whatever you want. And right back here, this is my rudder. And you can see here, I thought this thing would cut a lot more through the water, but what I found today is you end up doing a lot better in the drift, don't have to drop your anchor as much. Pretty cool. And finally, this is my anchor. I should got you pretty much your standard anchor. This thing opens up. Got it from uh, bottom to top so that if it does get hung, I do have the uh, zip tie on it so I can uh, release it. One of the cool things I did, and I stole this online I actually made this this is a stick a retractable stick that you can wash windows with but what it is I took a uh, pool noodle wrapped around there tightened it down and uh, this is what I you can imagine when I get the, all this the slack of this line on there. There's my anchor trolley right there. I had to move it to the front of the boat because I had it from front to back, but I didn't want to drill any holes um, when I put the rudder in. And it couldn't do the same thing with the rudder. So I use this, wrap it up, basically just hold it, give it a big twist, and I can wrap all my uh, 50 foot of line here. This lake here is about 48 to 54 foot, for, so there's some areas that it's a little too deep. You end up dragging a little bit, but um, cool thing is with the fish finder, it also has the depth perception and you can uh, find out exactly what your depth is. One of the things I've done with this is uh, I've tied knots uh, every 10 foot so that I can know as I'm letting the line out pretty much where I'm at so yeah I started out uh, originally I had a Mokin uh, extremely good boat loved it first one that I ever bought and uh, decided to upgrade a little bit uh, ended up getting the uh, lure 11.5 uh, from there first thing that I got was the uh, anchor trolley uh, then I added the uh, fish finder and the rudder kit so 
I've been happy so far.